what's going on guys in this video we are working on Kylo Ren anyways hey, I hope you guys enjoyed that little intro it's something I put on my Instagram so uh, if you guys follow me on Instagram then you already know what's coming up because I do all my sneak peeks on Instagram and I do some on Facebook too but anyways yeah man I hope you guys enjoy the video I'm using some all-purpose spray adhesive high-tech template maker on Mr. Ed and then you follow with some high-tech duct tape which is very difficult to find you can almost not find it in any store I drew out the basic lines for Kylo Ren's helmet and the best part of this helmet is it doesn't have to be perfect because this dude's helmet looked like it's been through some battle yeah everything looked like it was kind of glued on roughly well, according to the movie I'm using some quarter inch floor mats that that you can find at Walmart in the exercise section they actually come in a big roll and you can actually build a lot of stuff with it fairly cheap too so I heat formed applied my glue attaching all the smaller pieces together then I work my way in to a much larger piece and then I glue the back neck plate I guess that's what it's called and so far this is how it would look like now I am going to move on to working on the face plate I took a piece of paper and roughly drew on what the faceplate would probably end up looking like. Most of it is going to get covered. Some of it may actually get trimmed off once I put the mouth plate and those additional accents. So far so groovy. I'm going to glue it onto the rest of the helmet. And I want to make sure I have enough no space and breathing room and whatever. Apply some heat, full stretch and form until you get something that resembles a helmet. I'm applying some heat so I can round the edges of the eye areas in and I'm going to take some scrap pieces and cut them so I can fill up these little gaps that are left on this side of the helmet. And then I'm going to trim off the axis flare of his neck plate, whatever. Now I'm roughly sketching out the plates for his mouth. Then I folded the paper in half and cut out all the details. Then I cut my patterns out on some EVA floor mats. Then I'm going to use a wood burner to etch out the design just like that. You can actually use a razor blade and then apply some heat to give it that effect. But a wood burner would just make the lines a lot thicker. Here is the pattern that I'm going to use for the front mouthpiece and then again I'm going to use the wood burners so I can scribe in the additional details. Carefully applying the mouthpiece to the rest of the helmet making sure that it is well centered. I'm taking some 2mm craft phone and cutting out some quarter inch strip and applying glue to both the helmet and strips. And I used a, another small strip. This didn't have glue on it so I basically used it as a guide to make sure all my gaps was even i drew up some cheesy looking patterns this is gonna go right below his eyes that gives it the uh a cheesy effect then I'm going to glue it on now this may not look exactly like the Kylo Ren mask but close enough for me because you know it is cosplay I heat sealed the mask and I'm applying a couple coat of plasti dip then I'm gonna finish off by brushing on some chrome metallic paint to the accents on the mask Hey, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope y'all learned something and, and I will try to put the template for this build on my Facebook channel. One thing I forgot to mention was I put this metallic mirror chrome thingy majiggy. You can actually see through it. And I, I took it out and I glued it on there. I forgot to mention that in the video, but now I got it glued back on. Snapped it off. But anyways, and today's shout out goes to the Tabby Lemon asked for a shout out and he wanted me to plug his, his Instagram account is Clive2728. And that's a two for shout out right there. Yeah, so shout out your YouTube and your Instagram. I also want to give a shout out to Origins and Builds. Um, yeah. I have a bunch more. I try to go through my comments and I get bombarded by a whole bunch of comments, messages, and you know, I do actually read everything. I just have a lot of stuff going on and kind of do everything by myself. So follow me on Instagram, like me on Facebook, subscribe to this channel, and uh, 